Uh, hey everyone, this is Lockie um, from Lockie Fits and Films, and I'm just going to be doing a uh, requested tutorial. Um, been highly requested by many people um, on YouTube and like mates in real life and stuff wanting to know how to install Magic Lantern. And I had found recently, probably about four days ago, that the latest version has come out. Um, so I'm going to be showing you how to install that. Uh, the version is 2.3, so if you have another version, then I'll probably do another tutorial on how to upgrade. But this is really simple to do. All you need is the um, package that I will have a link to in the description. It has all the drivers, uh, sorry, all the firmware and uh, applications for Magic Lantern. Everything all in one pack, so you don't need to go looking around for it everywhere else. Um, so you get this uh, zip folder here and you just got to extract it and then you get this. Uh, in here you've got two options. This tutorial is for the 60D or 600D because they're relatively similar. Um, you can pretty much use this with any camera um, but yeah you just I can't really help you there because the only cameras that I know how to do it on is the 60D and the 600D um, as I have the 600D and my friend has the 60D. So that probably didn't make much sense, but yeah. So what you'll get is the firmware for the 60D, the 600D, and then the actual Magic Lantern package, um, which has all the stuff here. It's got an install file, which is really helpful and pretty much tells you how to do it quite easily, but I'm going to show you how to do it um, even more simply in video form. So what you want to do is, the first step is to update your firmware on your camera to the recommended uh, firmware for Magic Lantern. Now the recommended firmware for uh, the 600D is version uh, 0, 1.02, um, I think, um, quote, don't quote me if I'm wrong, but uh, this is the firmware that you need here. So what we're going to do is put in our SD card into our computer and you want to make sure that it is um, 30 gigabytes or smaller because 60 gig cards won't work for the first initial install. Depending on your camera you need to choose the right version uh, of firmware so because I had the 600D I'm going to go into here and copy this and place it straight on the root of my memory card so not in any of these folders just straight on the root path which is the main folder of my SD card so then what you want to do is just eject your memory card and now I'm going to take you over to the camera to show you how to do the uh, firmware update on the camera okay so we're, we're over here at the camera uh, what we need to do is change the camera into manual mode but first of all we need to put in the SD card into the camera and close the door then turn the camera on and change the mode to manual mode the reason you need to do this is because this is the only way that you can install Magic Lantern next you want to click the menu button and then go across to the third wrench and click on firmware version then go across to OK then wait for the screen to load up with the firmware that we've just put on the SD card this may take a little while depending um, it normally does take a little while so just wait when you see the desired firmware click OK and then OK to update and this is quite a slow process so I'm going to speed this up so once the updating finishes you want to click the OK button when it pops up and then your camera is successfully updated you want to click the menu button then go across to the first wrench select format make sure you hit low level format by using the recycling bin then click OK and wait for your card to format once your card's formatted just turn the camera off 
and then eject the SD card and then we're ready to go back to the computer to do the next stage okay, so we're back on the computer now so once we've uh, updated the firmware on our camera to the required firmware update for Magic Lantern to run uh, we need to put our SD card back in our computer and then bring up the finder window and uh, as you'll see we've formatted the card so it's just back to its original state now what we need to do is uh, we need to get uh, open up the magic lantern folder that I provided you with and go to magic lantern software and highlight everything and then just drag it over to your card and what this will do is this will put uh, all the Magic Lantern software on your SD card ready to install. So while that's loading uh, we can just wait and then we're gonna go and eject the card again and then go back over to our camera to install the Magic Lantern software. Okay, so the last step is to install the actual Magic Lantern. So you want to put your SD card back in your camera and close the door and turn the camera on. Uh, then you want to navigate to the menu button again, making sure that you have it on manual mode. Go to the third wrench, firmware version, uh, update, OK. Then wait for the screen to load up and this time the screen will go black and it will come up with a bunch of writing in green that says Magic Lantern has successfully installed then you can just turn your camera off and then turn your camera back on and Magic Lantern will be installed so now I'm just showing you how um, the basic how to get into Magic Lantern by clicking the recycling bin icon and there's so many new settings in Magic Lantern I'll probably, uh, in the new firmware update, I'll probably have a video to explain a bit more about the basic features of Magic Lantern a bit later, so if you'd like that then uh, leave a comment below and I'm more than happy to uh, get that underway. Uh, anyway, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video, if you want more videos like this then uh, leave a like and a comment, that would be great, uh, thanks.